a little bit of a whip and chat. And uh, I'm back. Oop, my phone doesn't want to work. My setup, I should say, doesn't want to work here. There we go. We're going to do a little whip and chat. Hopefully this will work for us today. Because I can always slide things over. So I'm working on a Spell Queen. Um, it is a 35 by 35 centimeter, in which case I do not know what that is in um, inches. And it is a queen bee. And it is, uh, there's a sequence number, SQD 310884. And again, um, it has a grand total of 26 um, drills. And two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16 of them are ABs, in which case you can see that there. 16 of these are ABs. So, um, yeah. And I hope that I'm straight. I mean, guys, I'd love it if you would come on and chit chat with me and all that good stuff. I don't know if I can um, see your comments or not. So I might have to pull out my tablet. Um, Cause I don't know how that goes. So where is my tablet? Um, I don't know what happened to my tablet. Well, I had my tablet. I don't know what happened to my tablet now, but I bet you my grandbaby took my tablet and she was playing with it. Well, I guess that's okay. I should be able to see your guys' comments once people start coming on and commenting. But yeah, I've been gone for a little bit, guys. I do apologize. Um, that's what um, I was coming on here to yip yap, and you know that's the whole point of a whip and chat is. Um, but I'd like to know how your guys' um, days, lives, and things like that are going. Um, you know, as I'm doing my diamond painting. Um, and again, guys. So I am using the um, Rand. Rhonda's Crafty Corner, and it is a putty for um, your, your diamond painting pens. So I am using that. Uh, let's see what number we want to do next. Let's do number one. Um, one is an AB, so I got to go all the way to the back here. It went too far. I got my things in bags instead of my other things, so it's a little harder to see in which case I'm not a fan of, but it's okay. And it is a yellow. So we're gonna do number one, like I said. So yep, yeah, so like I said, I've had this channel for uh, definitely over a year, and you can see I was a little bit busier back a year ago, but um, I had my dad come and visit, and when he came to visit, he had some surgery, and it didn't go so well, and um, life has just been crazy hectic, and then my mom had some surgeries. Um, and so forth and then of course i was on the road again in which case i don't mind being on the road i don't even mind doing my videos when i'm on the road because i'm at a hotel and it's good and stuff like that so that doesn't bother me but um just i didn't they didn't send me out on the road as much as um i wanted so when i was at home i was doing a lot of um care giving, um in which case that's what we're supposed to do our parents take care of us when we're little and we take care of them when, you know, when they're in need of help and so forth. I don't even know if you guys can see what I'm doing. In which case, I don't even know if, um, there we go. Like I said, I'm down here on the number ones. In which case, let me move that up. So I'm only working, working on these ones right here. The one right there and the ones over here and there's a couple other ones too so it's just i got my phone down here pretty low so i want to make sure so it looks like i'm going to jiggle it around so hopefully i can stop that that's okay and of course like some people you guys like to use like the multi placers i'm not a big fan of the multi placers um i mean i don't mind them but i do like to do this um the checkered board pattern um to make mine go straight. And I do have those metal things and stuff. Has anyone ever got those metal things to work that have the the holes in them? Because I have never 
And I have an example of one. Has anyone ever gotten these to work? I have never been able to get mine to work. They never line up, it seems like. Like, well, this one seems to line up. I had one. It wouldn't line up for the life of me. Like, forever. So I didn't know if anyone else has gotten theirs to line up or not. Um, but it was a way of supposedly um, keeping drills straight and stuff. So that's... I was wondering, like I said, I have that one and I have one for square too. And I even have a longer one for, um, ra circle or round drills. Um, yeah, but, um, like I said, I, I wasn't very able to get them to work very well. Um, so that's why I was curious as if anyone else got them to work. I got to clean out my pen here real quick. Or I don't even clean it up. So when my when my putty gets a little dull, I don't clean it up. What I do is I just like scoop it a little bit. I hope you guys can see that. I'm trying to see if so I just scoop it a little bit and then fold it over. And then it works. And I pardon my fingers. We've been pouring concrete um today at work. So my hands are just a little sore. But yeah, I just, um, like I said, I just uh, flip it over and make it tacky again. And then it works just like brand new putty. So that's that's how I do it. So if anyone else has any ideas or they do something different, let me know. But um, this putty is great because I can do that and I can use this pen for, I guess, a week and a half or so. Because that's all I keep doing is switching it. It's like almost like you just have to stir it up. And it works perfect again. So it's really nice. But I was just curious if anyone else has, uh, you know, any other ideas. But, uh, yeah. So um, how's everyone else doing? Like I said, uh, we've just been really busy with family things and life in general. Uh yeah <laughs> mom moving uh we moved her around to um she downsized so we ended up moving her around um and of course my dad with surgery and all that good stuff and my mom and her surgery um then my niece she ended up moving um yeah we just and then my husband he got a new position so we had to get um him situated in the town he was gonna work in so we got that all done. Um, yeah, like I said, it's just been really, really hectic. So that is all I know. Like super, super hectic. I have a little fruit fly flying around and it's driving me crazy, people. Drive me crazy. Oops. I keep bumping my phone. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't want to make you guys sick or anything from like motion sickness and i do apologize about my voice um with when we're pouring concrete it seems like i have to yell a lot louder so my voice kind of will yeah go away but it'll come back but yeah like i said so like i said, don't really technically work construction but um we do do some some things that is like construction so this little fruit fly is driving me crazy. That's all I can say, people. Driving me crazy. But, um, yeah, we built a salt shed. And uh, we already got the walls and the footer and everything else. Now we're putting the um, floor in. So that's what we're on. But uh, it's moving, around, you know, moving along quickly. It's just very dirty, very dusty. Um... Uh, yeah, very time consuming, you know, that kind of stuff. So, yeah, but oh, I would love if someone would hop on and chit chat with me and all that good stuff. I know, guys, I've been gone for a long time. So this might have been premature um, going on live. It's just, um, yeah, get you guys uh, back in the loop of what's going on in my life and all that good stuff. And why I haven't been making videos. But I'm going to start making videos again. Um, 
and so forth. Uh, and let me know, guys. So what do you guys want to learn? What do you guys want to... Uh, I don't know. I've been diamond painting forever. I've never stopped. Even though I wasn't filming, I never stopped. So um, what's... Like, let me... Let me know what kind of things that you're interested in because I can go over some of my old videos and maybe um, show people or let me know what I might be missing. Let me know what I might be out of the loop on and stuff like that because even though I haven't been able to film, I've been trying to keep up with everything, but I also haven't been able to check all the videos out. So um, anyone know of any new diamond painting groups, um, new diamond painting companies? anything like that let me know because i would definitely love to know this is spell queen and i found this company out from a youtube channel i don't know um i don't remember who the youtube creator was but she just randomly was talking about it and talking about how it was the company she um used that had a whole bunch of abs it was the first time that she ever seen a um a diamond painting that had a whole bunch of AB drills on their, um, you know, canvases. So I checked it out and their prices actually were pretty good. Um, they're, it's definitely faster than AliExpress um, and sometimes even Amazon for getting diamond paintings. And then it also, but depending on where you get your diamond paintings from, it might be a little slower as well too. Um, because I do love Craftably. Oh, I love their diamond paintings. I did that. Um, oh, I forgot what her name is. Cat Crazy Chloe. Oh, I love that one. I love, love that diamond painting. Um, I have it hanging on my wall. And it is so cute. I mean, it is my absolute positive fave diamond painting out of all of them. Um, and maybe it's because it little, little bit, itty bit reminds me of me. And our cats and stuff like that. So maybe that's why. So maybe I might be a little bit, um, what do you want to call that? Um, I forgot what the word is right now. I can't think. I did forget what the word was. But yeah, so I, I, I am so sorry, guys. I keep hitting my f camera. I'm not going to curse. I'm not going to curse. But uh, yeah, I... This one I like because it's a queen bee. And, of course, all of us women should be a queen bee in their home. Um, so I really do like this one. Um, and, I, and then, of course, I have a dragon one I'm going to finish next. I like that one, too. And then I think I'm going to do a video on my kitten down so people can see how I kit down my projects. Because I have, I think, three projects I have to kit down right now. Um... So I was going to show people how I do that because I do save my my drills. And um, if anyone needs any drills, like if you're short, you know, message me. Let me know. I can see if I have them. Um, and if I have to, I can send them to you because I can always message you back saying yes, send address, um, whichever. Because I do save my drills um, just in case I get a diamond painting that might be missing some drills or I've dropped my drills because we all know we have those days, those bunger days. Um, so like I said, definitely um, I'm going to do a video on my kitten down and I'll show you my different um, things that I enjoy. Um, there's one kit down I have right now for um, Diamond Art Club and all my drills are in it. And I absolutely positively love it. I need to get about five or six of them so that I can uh, use it on my... Um, and see, the other thing I don't like about AB drills is it does make my um, putty a little bit um, unsticky very fast. I have noticed that, but that's okay. But they're beautiful. But um, so I got these like little storage things for my Diamond Art Club paintings. And I love them, but there's not enough, I mean, there's enough holes, but I want six of them for my standard um, diamond art drill um, 
drills. Because, like I said, I made two of them special just for my Diamond Art Club um, di uh, paintings. Well, I would love to make or have enough for my other box. Because I have a box and it has a lot in them. A lot. Um, but I love the storage because it's just so neat and organized. So I do love that. Okay, I had to slide down so you guys can see which ones I was finishing. Like I said, I'm trying to finish this corner. So right now I just have seven and K, I think, left on this corner. But I'm trying to finish this corner so I can keep moving up and so forth. Because um, I normally work from right to left. Because um, it works a little easier. Um, then my arm's not hanging over. Oh, no, I got a V in there too. I see it now. And a V right there. So I do have that. But, yeah. And like I said, but I, 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 I mean, guys, anyone who diamond paints, they know how it is. It's relaxing, it's soothing, all that good stuff. So I love it. But like I said, I think the next video I'm going to do is my kitten down. Because like I said, I do have at least three kits to kit down. So I definitely want to do that. And I want to fix these bags too. Because... I, I don't like the way I did them. I hate working out of bags, just so everyone knows. Hate, hate working out of bags. Um, but I was out. That's why I need to kick down a couple of my kits. Because I was, yeah, just a little, I'm out of my little things. So I definitely need to um, do my kitting down. So next one's going to be the V. We'll, we'll do the V real quick. Since there's not very many of them. And then we'll do K. And then we'll do the 7. So, and V is um, just a regular drill. It's not the AB drill. And again, if you guys haven't subscribed, please subscribe so you can get the updates. Um, but like I said, I am going to try to go on here a lot more, guys. I do apologize about being missing for a little bit. Because um, I know once you, once you subscribe to something, you uh, try not to... I mean, you know, people like certain videos and so forth. So I super do apologize, guys. I've been gone for a while. I don't want to disappear on our or uh, the the diamond art group world out there. I want to stay in the loop. I want people to stay in the loop. So if I find stuff out or you guys know stuff, let me know. If you, if you guys got an idea of a video or a company you want me to try out, let me know so I can go ahead and get it ordered um, so I can get it coming and so forth. Because like I said, guys, the bad thing is we all know with diamond art, some of them take forever. And then, of course, like I've done before, I've done the verses. So if there is a company you want me to check out versus like Amazon or someone else, like I did Spell Queen versus Amazon because they both had identical um drill uh uh canvases so i did that like i said if anyone has um an idea to do something like that again with a, a different company that you may have seen that i didn't let me know uh, i i will try to get the two so we can do that um uh vice versa so you know versus um because again there wasn't much difference in those but there was enough there definitely was enough that I could see the difference um, and so forth. And then also, what if someone wants me to do a versa of um, a, a square versus um, round? I can try to do that as well, too, because I don't mind that as well. So, like I said, guys, let me know if there is a particular one you want me to. Um, this is the K. And it is a beautiful orange AB. But let me know if there's a particular A, um, you know, versus you guys want me to do. And I can do that. I have no, I think those are fun. It might take a while. So we can do a couple um, whipping chats with it. Um, and then also, if you guys want to do like um, maybe um, uh, a group thing. Sometimes like how people have those contests where um, you guys, you, you pick a, a topic and we um you 
you know, I get, I, I don't know how to word it per se, but I know they got them for Halloween and for Christmas. You guys pick out um, a particular subject. We get canvases to match it and everyone turns in their progress per week and by the end of a certain date um we can have a finished thing and people can judge it or you know I don't know how you do the judging but we can do a judging and stuff like that and we can um go ahead and do try to do a giveaway you know I can always go ahead and get like a diamond art uh, canvas to give away or maybe some tools or stuff like that um, for people to, uh, you know, win and stuff like that. So, and like I said, I like doing that kind of stuff. I tried to do it the one time, but it didn't kind of work out very well. I tried, but um, I think what it was is I didn't have yeah, my canvas didn't come in in time. That's what it was. My canvas didn't come in in time. And I was like, oh, man. So I was kind of bummed because it put me two weeks behind everyone else. So I definitely couldn't keep up or catch up. So I just finished the, the project anyways because I liked the diamond, um, the canvas I bought and all the good stuff. But... Um, yeah, like I said, we can do something like that maybe. Maybe for Valentine's, Christmas. Um, I don't know. We can get that, you know, we can get something like that started or something. So, like I said, uh, let me know, guys. Like, it would be nice to have a nice community again and uh, chat things over, um, get some... Um, I don't know how you want to word it. Some cute um, uh, tools and stuff and try them out before you guys try them out to let you guys know if they work or don't work. Um, that kind of stuff. Let me know. Like, I definitely want to know um, if people need help uh, framing their diamond art. Uh, all that good stuff. I, I mean, I'm willing to try to do the best I can to help someone out if they, if, especially if they're new or the beginners or anything like that, uh, let me know because, like I said, you, you, if you're new and you're just coming into Diamond Art, um, my gosh, it's so much fun. It's so relieving, so relaxing. Um, yeah, I love Diamond Art. Like, yeah, I think I'm on to five years of now Diamond Art. Or diamond art. I'm not quite sure. Um, but I know I started in 2018. And now it's 2023. Um, but I've loved it. I, I've never... It's never something I've not... I've put down. I've always... Ever since I got started, I have always um, kept going. So it's just something that my anxiety definitely in calms me so especially on a stressful day at work but that's about it so but i wish i knew what you guys were all up to um i don't know if this live is working properly or not so if it didn't and it didn't give you guys notification please let me know um because i just want to know you guys are definitely getting the notification that I'm going live. Um, if it's even something you guys are interested in or if I should just do the videos. Sometimes people like to yip yap and chit chat and all the good stuff. Cause I like it, I do like it. Oh, and I do have a TikTok guys. If you guys wanna go over there and follow me. Um, I do try to do silly videos and stuff. My grand, you might see my grandbaby in some of them of unboxing of certain diamond paintings and stuff like that. I haven't seen an unboxing in forever, guys. Like I said, I have been out of this loop just a little bit, just a little bit. I've been un out of the loop, so I need to get back in the loop. You know what I'm saying? 
So I need to watch a couple unboxings and things like that. That's what I need to start doing again. I just haven't done it in a while. This pen is almost a little too long because, like I said, I keep bumping my camera. And it's probably driving you guys insane, so I do apologize. I'm trying to fix a little bit of stuff here. I got cats running wild. The dog must be driving them crazy. That's okay, though. They just play with each other. But, son, so I'm back. And if that upsets anyone, I do apologize. But I'm back, back, back for the long run, for the long run. But, so, I mean, like I said, oh, my gosh, my voice is really getting worse. No, I'm good. Thank you, though. I'm live. I'm good. Thank you, though. Just throw it away. What? Well, then put it in a uh, container and put it in the fridge for tomorrow. Yeah, that was one of the kids. Um, again, guys, like, I mean, I go live and I, I really kind of, I don't even block them out anymore out of my videos and stuff. My kids are my kids and this is what they're going to do. And I do edit, I do edit my videos, but family's family and you guys will kind of see all that kind of stuff with my videos and so forth um there is a bead right there let's see if i can get it off there we go see oh i dropped it where'd it go i will obviously find it again somewhere i don't see where it went that's okay i'll find it eventually yeah, so my family's my family, and I try not to, like, yeah, you'll hear the grandbaby playing. She'll come in, ask me questions. She loves to try to diamond art, but she's a little young still, so we keep buying her very small ones um, so she can keep practicing and practicing, but she likes this little art as well. She's also, I used to do crocheting, well, I crochet as well, too, depending on what my travel um, thing is in the car, what we're doing. Um, oh, I put that in the wrong spot. So um, she's tried to crochet, too, but, again, she's only eight, so she definitely tries. Um, but it's not something we've that she was always interested in. So now that she tries, she definitely tries. In which case is all that matters. She tries. So, and I've gotten her, like, very small diamond art kits and stuff. Um, yeah. The wood ones or um, the bracelet ones because she loves bracelets. Yeah, so I'll get her those kind of things. But she definitely thinks it's fun. She doesn't like the kidding up. Or the kidding down. She just wants to. She wants Mama D to hurry up and get it ready for her. So she can start doing it. Um, so I told her patience. You got to do it the proper way. Um, you know you got to. I keep hitting the plastic. Oh well. But um, you know she has to do it the proper way. She has to do it in the order. So I kind of try to show her that. Because if you don't do it in order. Then you. It, it's going to just be time-consuming, longer and longer and longer. It just becomes more time-consuming. So, yeah. But she, again, cute little grandbaby. That's all I can say. So, that one won't pick up. It wouldn't pick up for me. But yeah, I like to do the checkerboard uh, method. The checkerboard method makes sure that they're straight. So they come out a little bit straighter than they would if you just went straight down a line. Um, I don't know the, the method behind that why. It just really does work. Um, someone showed me that trick and or I watched it somewhere. And like I said, I didn't believe it. 
and it worked the very first time, so I like to do that. I do have my straight um, scrapers, you know, to also make sure my lines are straight. But more often than not, if I do the checkered board, I don't even need to do that. So that's my plus. My Lulu is crazy. What Lulu? She's my little dog. She's a Jack Russell and a uh, wiener dog mix. She is adorable. She's black and white. What are you doing? There's nothing over there for you. No. <laughs> she knows I'm talking about her because she's looking at me like, what? What do you want? So, she's funny. I need to do a custom picture of her one of these days, too. We only have the one dog right now. We have four cats, one dog. Um, so, we're, we and the, the three of them are sisters. And one is, you know, the not sister. But she is a hoot. They are so funny together, all of them. So they're funny. Well, you heard my back door slam. <laughs> that was that. Oh, and there's the dog barking. Because my daughter-in-law came in with the grandbaby. So, yep. Like I told you guys, I do not hide the family. I don't know what they're doing, but I think they're giving the baby boy a bath. The grandbaby a bath. So that's okay. So, but that's what I'm doing, guys. Whipping chat. I'm back. Where'd baby boy go? Yes, you can. Yeah, you can. Just cold. She can. No, you already piece. No, you can't keep doing that. Can't spit out gum like that. No. What? Oh. Well, I don't know what to tell you. I don't think you need gum anyways because you had a dentist appointment tomorrow. You need to actually brush your teeth and stuff. No. Yeah. What? What do you mean you're not ready? To brush your teeth? Oh, okay, before bed? Almost bedtime. She's silly. She has a dentist appointment tomorrow. Okay, guys. Well, I'm going to... Oh, hi. Who came on? Let me know. Why are you live? I need my tablet. That was me. You was came on? Confused. You're still on. No, I clicked off. No, you clicked off. Why did you go to your tablet? <laughs> I don't know. Baby girl took it. I went live to try to let people know I'm back. Way too close. Way too close. No, you have to be close. No, that's way too close. Let it's me like, see your phone. You're, it's on my computer. You're up close in person. Like, well, you're supposed to be so people can see what you're doing. Like, that is like, it's almost so close it gets blurry. I can't zoom out. I can't. Now my child's trying to tell me you guys are too close. So let me go ahead and see if I can. No, I don't want that. I couldn't find it, baby girl. Oh, that just fell off. Did you break it? Well, it fell off. Trying to you broke it. adjust it. No, it didn't break. I unscrewed it too far. It didn't break it. It was in here. So I can see if someone's on and stuff. But I don't know how you're saying I'm too close. I, I'm very close. I'm well, my kid is saying I was too close. Was I too close, people? Let me know. Okay, let me hop on my tablet. It's dead. No, it's not, is that? I'm pretty sure it's dead. It, no, it was just off. Someone turned it off. Okay, that color. Hi, baby boy. Is the dog getting him? Yes. 
I didn't know if the dog was bothering him. Let me do something here real quick. Yeah, the dead guys. That's not good. Okay, well, I will. I like this video, and I will go live another night. Um, like I said, I just want everyone to be aware that I'm back. Let me know what you'd like to see in the next video, or let me know what you'd like to see on the next live, and we can go ahead and do that. You guys have a nice night. Enjoy. Bye.